Bill. Bill, where are you? Campbell, look, I know it's last minute, but I can't play golf today. But we were gonna meet and talk about Barbara. It's important. Yeah, speaking of, I'm meeting with her attorney today. They insisted. We'll play next week when the divorce is final. Are you serious? I'm standing here at the first tee. I'm waiting for you. You know I don't like to play with walk-ons. Don't worry. You're playing Desert Dunes. They all golf like pros there. Yeah, well, look, I, I just wanted to talk some things over with you. It'll be fine. You have to understand, even the most amiable divorces are stressful. What you need is a nice, relaxing round of golf. No, what I need is a miracle. Miracle? What miracle? How did you... Do you mind? I don't mind. Do you mind? I mind a little. <sighs> Listen, pal, I have to go. I want to wrap this up for you today, okay? Yeah, well, take your time. You know how I feel about Barbara. I don't want this to be over. I know. I'll talk to you later. Yellow! So, what do you think? Divorce, huh? Oh, yeah. Definitely Splitsville. Excuse me? Kind of a private conversation. You mind waiting over there? What? Go. Thanks. Why do you think she's leaving him? Five bucks says it's trouble communicating. I bet you it's trouble in the bedroom. I think his routine got stale. Maybe he's an alcoholic. A workaholic. Maybe he's got a hottie on the side. Mm. Nah. nah. He's a tightwad. Gambling man. Crossdresser. Vegetarian. Klansman. Drugs. Physical abuse. You think he beats her? Hey, hey, no, no. Who the hell are you guys? <laughs> well, this is Benny, and I'm Dick. Guess we're playing golf with you. Oh, oh Dick, will you look at that? Wow, animal. Pray for me. Ah, not bad. A little left. One of my better drives. Wait, that's a penalty. Huh? Hit again. Lost ball, that's a rule. <laughs> it's not lost. It's uh, just over that path and somewhere in those bushes. Oh, that's ridiculous. Hey, hey, lighten up, Mr. Soon-to-be single. We're out here having a little fun. Ooh. Ah, piss on a shingle! And work on our vocabulary. Breakfast? You buying? I'm trying to golf here. So, Campbell, what's your wife's name? Come on, you guys. I'm sorry, but I mean, technically, she is still your wife, right? Right. Yeah. Mm hmm. Bummer. You want to know the secret to a successful marriage? No. Well, I'll tell you, Campbell. You got to be considerate, to be understanding. <laughs> And to forgive. Forgiveness is key. Any kids? Four. 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 Hey, you know, you divorce is always toughest on the children. No, I don't have any. Would you? Ugh. I've been married 17 years. 19 and counting. <sighs> oh, sorry. You know, Campbell, my wife's like the 10W40 in my riding mower. Yeah, that's great, Dick. Glad to hear it. My wife, Alice, is the apple of my eye. Honey, yo! <laughs> I tell you, my wife Janice, she's my best friend. Uh, no offense, Betty. Yeah, I'm good. My wife Alice is the cream in my Twinkie. <laughs> Sunblock? You know, my wife's the talcum powder in my bowling shoes. Watch it! My contacts! You ready for a beer now? No! I am. Set me up. You got it. This is ridiculous. Idiot! Hey, Mr. Sandman, you forgot your bag! Oh, yeah. Forget your divorce. Have some laughs. Go golfing! 
What's with him? I don't know. <laughs> Still in? Still in? It's in the next county, for Christ's sake. Take a penalty. Christ. Of all the golfers, they stick me with you two bozos. Hey, don't take it out on us just because your marriage is going down the tubes. Hey, you mind your own business. You're right. It's none of our business. But your marriage sucks because you're an uptight a-hole. A-hole? Who says a-hole? Oh, you think that after a couple of holes of golf, you know me? Yep, yep pretty, pretty much. much. Forget it. Forget it? You can't forget it. That's the problem. If you could just loosen up a little, you might actually be able to save your marriage. Yeah, on the phone earlier, you said you didn't want it to be over, right? Right. So why don't you just tell your wife how much she means to you, and then spice things up with a porno. If golf is your thing, golf with her. Hey, dress up as a motorcycle cop, frisk her, and use your cuffs on her. Share with her a half gallon of Ben & Jerry's Chunky Monkey ice cream. <laughs> okay, maybe that only works with my wife. I've seen her. She can really put it away. <laughs> Easy there, a-hole. This is great. Marital advice from Beavis and Butthead. Listen, if married life with you is anything like golfing with you, maybe she should leave you, because you're probably making our life frickin' miserable. What did you say? Which part? I mean, we've been talking to you all day. Where, where's he going? I don't know. Probably to take a leak. Hello? Hi, honey. It's me. Hey, did I actually hear you say that he should go golfing with his wife? My marriage isn't in trouble, is it? <laughs> I was gonna say. <laughs> Although, uh, Alice has expressed an interest in playing. You know, it might actually be kind of fun to play golf with the girls, huh? Nah. Here comes Mr. Happy. That was quick. Well, he didn't have any beer. Oh, yeah. Sorry, pal. It's a penalty. Lost ball. <laughs> lost ball? Not lost ball. It's uh, it's over that path and somewhere in those bushes there. What's with him? Nothing. I just uh, I made a date at Ben and Jerry's. Ah, Ben and Jerry's. <laughs> <laughs> I'm lost. His wife. Oh. <laughs> Come on, yeah! Ah. I can't believe it! Huh? I played an 
entire round, I never lost my ball. Really? Yeah, yeah. We're here. How about that? Hey! <laughs> that was my lucky ball. Hey, Campbell, how about a beer? Oh, no thanks. I gotta go. Big date, remember? One beer, we can split it. I'll uh, take a rain check. A rain check? Hey, Nick, did you hear that? Campbell wants to go for this again. Oh, no. Let's not get carried away. Carried away. Hey, hey, listen, you guys. You gave me some terrific advice. Uh, especially the handcuffs. I really like that part. I think that's going to really turn my whole marriage around. <laughs> <laughs>